enforcement agencies in the area are working to improve their response times for emergencies. News 3's Madeline O'Neill tells us what Rock County officials are doing to streamline their process and save precious time in case of a crisis. Madeline? Charlotte and Eric, the about a dozen law enforcement agencies in Rock County are signing on to an agreement to set up a system called MARS, or the Mutual Aid Response System. Officials say it will shave seconds off of response time, which then can save lives. During a big emergency. There are times of the week that I have a single officer working. City of Milton Police Chief Scott Marquardt knows he'll need to request help from other agencies. This is crucial for me. But that can take time. Those seconds matter. We're seconds that could be better spent elsewhere. You can move on to those life-saving tasks without having to worry about now which officers from which jurisdiction do I need to get here right now. Right now, during an emergency in the county, the commander on scene has to call in help from agencies in other jurisdictions individually. If I'm having an active shooter and I get on the radio and I say, send me everything, they can't do that. Plus, what is everything? But cards like these. This is an example of one where the threat is a structure fire with an area in the city there's fire hydrants. Help fire departments in the county streamline the process by creating a sort of shorthand for calling on help. Predetermining those resources allows the incident commander to focus on the emergency at hand. It's called MABIS or the Mutual Aid Box Alarm System. Through it, the Beloit Fire Department either provides or receives aid about 50 times a year. The uh, quicker you can get the resources on scene, uh, it reduces the uh, impact of the emergency. Now Rock County law enforcement agencies are adopting a similar system called MARS. It's a shorthand. The Mutual Aid Response System. I can just say, give me level one through three of a MARS activation, and I'm done with that. Something Marquardt says has the potential to make all the difference. When you think about the scope of an active shooter incident, and all of the resources that takes, we absolutely need help there quickly. And again, this is the best way to shortcut that process. Rock County law enforcement agencies began signing the Mars Agreement at Black Hawk Technical College today. We'll work on getting it set up this spring. Madeline O'Neill in the studio tonight. Thanks, Madeline.